Though most people that we see with cataracts are over the age of 55, they can actually occur in newborns as well. Cataracts can also occur in people that have some sort of metabolic disease, things like um, uh, adrenal gland tumors or even um, some people with diabetes can develop cataracts about 10 years earlier than is the usual age-related cataract. The cataract is the lens of the eye. It's the lens of the eye turned cloudy. So when we remove a cataract, we're removing the lens. And the lens itself cannot grow back. Now, what can happen, and is erroneously called a secondary cataract, is that the little capsule which holds the lens in place, we leave that there to receive an artificial lens implant. That little capsule can turn cloudy after a number of months or years. In fact, it occurs with about 20% of all people who've had cataract surgery. That's not really the cataract growing back though. Your lens doesn't grow back. That's really just a scar that develops in the back of the lens implant that can also impede your vision just like a cataract would. And it just simply needs to be treated with laser. Real quick treatment, just takes a minute. Generally speaking, if your cataract surgery has been routine, I let my patients go back to exercise the very next day. The only thing I ask my patients to do is to stay out of the swimming pool. Uh, so as not to get exposed to uh, possible infection.